Hey guys, Derek here. Merry Christmas, Christmas morning here. I don't know, we got all our presents. It's almost lunchtime. The, the grandkids are down from the nap and I found out that Midas uh, really doesn't care about anything but boxes, toilet, uh, wrapping paper tubes and climbing on stuff. And I'm like, okay. So I'm headed over to the shop and we're gonna see if we can build him a climbing wall that we can bring in the house. Uh, so he's got something to climb on besides the kitchen counter. I'm here at the shop and looking what I got for scrap plywood. Uh, I'm gonna go with this one. It's a little bit rougher, but it's the three quarter inch thick. And so it's gonna be a little bit heavier. I can, I think I can just lean it on the wall or put one screw into the wall and it'll be good enough for a 18 month old to climb on. And then we've got some strips here. We're just gonna cut these and we're gonna sand the beveled edges on them a little bit. I uh, got a couple of pieces in different thicknesses. We'll bevel the edges and then cut them into blocks. And I'm just gonna screw them on here and uh, we'll have our, our Got the bench sander going that we never use. And all I'm doing is just rounding off the edges of these. I'm gonna round off both sides so that when we screw it to the wall that we'll have a little gap there that he can get his little fingers kind of back in there if he needs to. Okay, I have this random strip here. And is what it is. First is I rounded the edges as one big piece. And you can kind of see that right there, just to where that softened them up. And then I cut them into just random shapes. And then I came over when I started rounding the edges, I said, you know what, we can make them look more like a rock and give them some texture to it. So all we're doing is just holding them up against the sander, rounding off the edge. Just kind of holding it there. And that's giving us more of a, a textured spot on it. Okay, always being the, the lean guy and the impatient guy, I was doing these one at a time. Um, and so now is what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I'm gonna bevel the edge on the whole strip, but I'm also gonna put some of these marks on it as the whole strip so that it will reduce the amount of work that I need to do on each individual piece. So that worked out good. It got a lot better handle on it and I went through and just bumped up both sides of it. And now we're gonna cut it on the chop saw. Okay, we had a little bit of a rough piece of plywood. We just uh, gave that a quick sand down so we don't get any splinters. We took these guys and we shaped each one individually, give a little bit of grab space behind it, depending on how it is. And I got big sausage fingers, but my 18 month old guy has got smaller fingers, so this all work out. We screwed them all in. I'm gonna run a sander across the front of it, make sure there's no burrs on any of the screws. And some of these screws are a little bit long. We're gonna do the same thing on the back side, and I'll show you the next one will be him climbing on it. <laughs> Look at you go. You like that? Go across. Oh. I got it. 